Zimbabwe is part of southern Africa. For many years, the former British colony fought a guerrilla war against the white racist Ian Smith regime until gaining independence in 1980. The liberation fighter Robert Mugabe became their first president and continues to occupy the presidency. Through the decades, the 88-year-old Mugabe has transformed from an ideal democratic politician into a cold-blooded dictator. The Church of Chinoy stands at an important threshold. The transformation from a mission church, which was built in the past mostly by German Jesuits, into a local, truly native church. This is a very important step, the transition from a mission church to a local church, the support that we brought from Germany and that actually accompanied us all of our lives, throughout all of our work, like cars, motorcycles, donations for buildings, hospitals, schools, orphanages. This is what the local priests do not have and what makes their jobs much more difficult. hope is we can become a local church when a local person, a local a Zimbabwean person becomes the leader of the diocese. And that should also be coupled with a diocese that is able to sustain itself without so much of this begging, this uh, like always failing to have our focus on the pastoral work, but always focusing on how much money do we need and where can we get that money from?